guys welcome back to my channel i know i know don't worry about this it looks a mess right <laughs> we're gonna do something with it right now today i'm gonna show you how i do an afro puff on a freshly washed hair okay my hair right now is still about 50 percent wet okay i'm just gonna show you quickly what i'm working with okay so yeah, we are. The things you're gonna need, or I'm gonna be using, is um, Eco Styler Gel. Okay, is the argan, the one with the argan oil. Yeah, here we are. And um, this brush. Okay, this brush. I've oh, I love this brush, guys. Is the diamond brush. Okay, I use it only, mainly, mainly only when I'm doing an Afro puff, and it, it helps to lay the head down flat and smooth okay that's why i like it so we're gonna be using this so let's get and yes as well we're gonna be using this one as well okay just a large hairband okay so let's start i'm just gonna like uh, push my hair up a bit just to try and um uh, uh anyway I'm just going to encourage it to kind of like go to the top because this is where I'm going to hold my puff or bun. Okay. So we're going to gradually start applying the gel. Okay. Okay, so I apply gel all the way around. Okay, I don't really like putting my hair in a bun, guys, because I have a massive forehead. I really do. So, <laughs> honestly, when I do an Afro puffs, they are usually for emergencies, okay? Because the first time I did an Afro puff, I think what happened was I had um I did a twist out with a product that I've never used before and it gave me so much flakes. I had about an hour to get out of the house. So when I start when I started unraveling my twist, I noticed that I had so much flakes in my hair and there was no way I was gonna go out like that. Okay. So I decided to quickly wash my hair and I did. And then when I finished, I put my hair up in a ponytail. And when I went out, people were like, oh, that's nice. That's nice. So since then, I, 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 I uh, started wearing Afro puffs every now and then, you know. It's so convenient. So after I applied some of the product, I'm just going to start, like, smoothing it down a bit. Yeah. With the brush. Just brushing it upwards. Okay. Okay, apply as much product as you think you need. Yeah. okay so when you've applied the product usually what i do i just put the bun around my neck like so and then i push it up a bit on top of my um ear well not on top but obviously just and then i just put it round round my hairline okay This is just a quick, a quick bun, okay? So I'm gonna turn around and then I'm gonna, okay? So I'm just gonna quick, I'm just gonna slide it down, yeah? Okay, now I'm just going to turn around and adjust the front. Mm 
Okay, just trying to smooth down my edges a little bit. So just um, play with it until you get the desired look that you're looking for, okay? So I do this hairstyle on a, when I'm just in a, a rush, trying to get out of the house and maybe I, I washed my hair that day or, okay? And don't know what to do with it yet. I just put it in a bun like so, and then I'm out, okay? I'm just gonna turn around for you guys to see what it looks like at the back. Voila! Yeah, we got. I hope you guys like it. Okay. Thanks for watching once again. Never mind the big forehead. Next time I will show you how to do a puff, yeah, and leave enough hair at the front to cover your, you know, forehead. Yeah, right now I don't care. I'm in a rush. I want to go out and do my daily activity and come back. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you later in my next video. Hope you do come back and see me again. Thank you. Bye.